today compared to what we've been feeling. I think everybody's knowing that we've got warmer temperatures coming <laughs> yeah. and it's just kind of the mindset right, right. now. Like, hey, it's almost here and it's coming <laughs> soon. One thing I did notice today, if you look out at some of your gutters, if you're on a second floor, yeah. they are completely frozen over with ice. So that could be something to watch for tomorrow evening as we'll have a chance for some precipitation moving in. All forms of precipitation possible. We could see some snow, we could see some sleet, some freezing rain, and even just some plain old rain as we go through Sunday night into Monday morning. Right now, we've got quiet conditions across central Indiana, clear skies and not a lot of wind out there. It's currently 16 degrees in downtown Indianapolis with clear skies around central Indiana, single digits to the north in Peru where it's four, six in Lafayette, 10 in Muncie, 12 officially in Indianapolis and 16 degrees right now in Bloomington and not a lot of wind, so not much of a wind chill to deal with unless you're up in Peru where it currently feels like it's five degrees below zero. Overnight, our temperatures will drop to right around four degrees in Indianapolis to about one below in Peru, but most low temperatures should occur between around 11 o'clock tonight and probably one o'clock in the morning as we'll start to see clouds moving in from the south or the southwest. Our winds will start to turn out of the southeast overnight, beginning to bring some warmer temperatures and some warmer air up our way. Hour by hour forecast for tomorrow. We'll start tomorrow morning around 11 or 10 degrees up to 14 by 9, 26 degrees by 1 o'clock, which will be the first time we've been over 20 degrees in about 12 days, and then up near freezing. We're actually forecasting our temperature in Indianapolis to be just below freezing tomorrow afternoon. We'll get above freezing in Columbus and in Bloomington with a high of 33 and 34 degrees and a bit cooler to areas to the north where temperatures will only be in the upper 20s. Look for a mainly cloudy day as we go through the day tomorrow. Now we are watching a weather system. It's back to the west. You can see all the clouds clouds just west of us. These will slide in during the overnight hours, but then if you look just to the west of Denver, back towards the western side of the Continental Divide, there's a weather system that's producing snow out there that's going to come our direction for tomorrow evening into Monday morning. Ahead of it, winter weather advisories have already been posted in Missouri as well as portions of Illinois. Wouldn't be surprised if we get those issued here early tomorrow morning for tomorrow night's weather system as it moves in. You'll see it start to pick up on future views starting tomorrow afternoon. I want you to know most of tomorrow will be, be dry in Indiana, at least daytime hours. It's tomorrow evening we'll start to see moisture moving in. And with the radar maybe showing mo moisture, but we've got dry air, so I think we'll see some of the actual moisture not reaching the ground just yet, even though the radar is detecting it. We will start to see some of that moving in here. Initially, I think we'll see a burst of some snow, then it changes over to a mix of uh, snow, some maybe freezing rain and sleet before ending as some snow early Monday morning as the system slides out of here. And of course, just in time to affect the morning commute. And uh, we, so we may be dealing with a little bit of freezing rain in some areas around here. Our latest uh, future view computer model suggesting light amounts of ice accumulation. But again, just even one hundredth of an inch could cause big problems around the area Monday morning. So keep that in mind. We may have some slick roads to deal with and even maybe a little crusty ice on your cars as well as you're going out there in the morning. Perhaps a better chance for some ice accumulation over the southern part of the state. And we'll also see a chance for a little bit of snow around here. I think we're talking less than an inch of snow in most locations. So timing it out for you. Notice we'll see a little burst of snow by around 7. Then we change over to the mix as we go through early Monday morning. Your seven-day forecast still has warm temperatures ahead. 36 degrees Monday, 38 Tuesday. And look at this. Perhaps we get up in the low 50s, maybe even mid-50s by Thursday. It's short-lived. 49 Friday, we fall. I have only 26 degrees by next weekend with a chance for some morning Bring snow. Bring out the shorts, come Thursday. <laughs> I, I, you'll probably see some people in yeah. shorts, I would imagine. All right, John. Thanks so much, Indy.